Hello there. Well, just before the break, we were telling you about that new movie with Professor Stephen Hawking, one of the most famous scientists in the world, of course. Well, Alan Duffy is a research fellow in the, the School of Physics at the University of Melbourne. He joins us live now from Melbourne. Mr. Duffy, what explains the huge appeal of Stephen Hawking, do you think? I think his appeal is twofold. Uh, in the first case, he is a fantastic communicator. He can break down the most complex of theories into just everyday language and do that with a really wicked sense of humor. Uh, but the second part is, it is a human interest story. He has achieved so much with, with just an unbelievable debilitating disease. Um, and that's a really compelling story, I think. Hawking himself said in that piece we ran just before the break that he gets attention, he thinks, because of his disability. Would he have been so popular without it if he was just a, just a genius scientist? Just a genius scientist, yeah. It, it's an interesting term. He is a genius, there is no doubt. And I think his, he specialized in very interesting fields, explaining how the universe began and how black holes form. So mm. those are very interesting topics. And I think he would always have been well known, mm. but perhaps maybe just not so well known if he didn't have the disability. Right, so how should people think of him? And ultimately, how would Stephen Hawking be remembered? Well, he's going to be remembered for two reasons. One, the science, his discoveries are incredible, but also as an educator. He has made science accessible to tens of millions of people who have bought his book. And he's also inspired generations of scientists, including myself, to go into the field. So I think his legacy is, is secure. So you'll be watching that movie then? Oh, absolutely. <laughs> Just as soon as you get broadcast okay, here. Okay, Alan in Duffy there from the University of Melbourne. Thank you very much for joining us. Thank you.